Hey guys, Richie from Mustang Auto Parts here. Today we've been fortunate enough to feature a customer's 1969 GT500 Shelby. The 69 Shelby was really one of the more polished Shelbys that um, they released in the early Mustangs. Similar to the earlier models, they changed a lot of the bodywork and the badging. Uh, upgraded bits and pieces to make them go better. But as far as the complete package, the 69 really was the peak. In 69, Shelby did sort of lean towards more creature comfort, so you'll find the deluxe interior. Maybe a little less performance, but uh, this particular model still has the big 428 Cobra Jet. So starting from the front of the car, they changed the front end completely. You'll notice the, the very aggressive fiberglass bonnet, which has five scoops, some of them feeding the ram air system. Then you look at the grill and it's completely different to a factory 69. Obviously they've gotten rid of the second lights with just the one pair of headlights and then it has the, the driving lights further down. On the front guard, you'll see a scoop, which is functional and you'll also notice the, the big Shelby stripes that run right down the side of the car. When you get to the back of the car, you'll see Shelby's gone with the ducktail sort of look again. Completely different rear end. It's got the 68 Cougar tail lights and one of the more funkier things is the number plates moved up to between the tail lights and there's a flap which pulls down and hides the fuel filler. Further down from that, you'll notice the cast aluminium exhaust tips. On a fastback, it would have different scoops further up the quarter. On this particular model, being a convertible, they go with the smaller scoops that sit further down the quarter panel. Once we move to the interior, it's basically a deluxe interior with Shelby add-ons. So you'll see the Shelby steering wheel, the Shelby door badges, and in the center console, he's added two extra gauges, oil pressure and amperage. The other cool part is the roll cage, which both the convertible and the fastback cop. You'll notice on the convertible, it's got little clips on the top of the roll cage. They reckon that was so you could carry a surfboard. In 69, uh, they brought out this five spoke cast wheel with the chrome lip. This particular Shelby, the owner's gone for the period correct polyglass tires, which just finished the classic look. Overall, this car has got a real mean presence on the road, but actually drives beautifully. It's got all of the nice little creature comforts inside. It's super comfy and easy to drive. It's got power steering, for example, um, tilt away steering wheel, all those really cool little 70s features. This is an awesome example of a classic Shelby.
Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and we'll catch you on the next one.